do you have enduring principles that drive the way you live? Well, if that describes you, you likely have belief as a part of your top five in your Clifton Strengths. And in today's episode, we're gonna explore the belief theme and we're starting right now. Hey everyone, my name is Gordon and welcome to another episode. If this is your first time with us and you want to learn more about Clifton Strengths, living a strengths-based life, and anything else related to leadership, don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification so you don't miss any cool updates. Hey, so as you know, uh, we've been exploring the Clifton Strengths 34 themes. And so in today's episode, we're going to delve deep into belief. But also, if you want to catch more of the episodes in this series, don't forget to check out the link here because uh, I can't remember where it is. Uh, but then also, leave us a comment below. Tell us, uh, tell us what your top five is and tell us how you're using that top five to be your best self. So today we're exploring the belief theme. So the belief theme is an executing theme. So it's about getting things done. But belief is interesting because it's really about understanding these enduring principles that you believe in that drive your work they can be individual to the person uh, based on who they are their life experiences and what they value but they're driven by what it is to be principled what it means to have ethics what it means to have character and morals and it really becomes the foundation for what they believe you should be doing and how you should be pursuing your goals, how you should be pursuing your work, how you should be leading others. It's all through this lens of belief. And belief is really about understanding who you are and why you do the things that you do. It's about this core set of enduring understandings, enduring principles that really drive who you are and why you do what you do. So if you want to really focus on what are the key metrics and the key ideas and concepts of somebody who has belief. It's about making constant progress, but being driven by what are the values and what are the principles that should be driving my work? How do I gravitate back to those things and how do I use those as my North Star, as my center, as my core enduring beliefs? So belief is really about how do we go about doing our work? How do we go about getting results, but having uh, deep conviction and deep connection to the work that we're doing from the principled perspective? That's what belief is all about. So if you like today's episode, give us a thumbs up, like the video, share it with a friend and subscribe to the channel. And for more information on our Clifton Strengths. 34 series. Don't forget to hit and check the links up here. Um, and for more information on Clifton Strengths resources and coaching, don't forget to check the description below. It's always a privilege and a pleasure to serve this community. Adding value to people's lives using Clifton Strengths and leading using these leadership principles, these leadership values is really what it's all about. Everybody needs a coach. Everybody should be on this path towards growth and stretching yourselves to do your best work, to lead people better, to just be a better human being. And so hopefully that's what this channel is providing to you. And so until the next time, I want you to be well, take care of each other, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.